This guide shows you how to remove McAfee from your Windows 10 based computer. Now there's nothing wrong with McAfee but uh, you might have found that you bought a new computer and McAfee's pre-installed on it and uh, the trial version is installed and it runs out after 30 days and you might be thinking I want to use a different antivirus or even use the uh, pretty good free included antivirus with Windows 10. Okay so first of all we move our mouse down to the start button and left click once. Then we move our mouse over the cog, just here, the settings cog, and again, left click once. I'm just gonna get rid of this your subscription expires soon message just here. Okay, just to get it out of the way. Um, and then we move our mouse over apps, and again, left click once. Now, it comes up here with a list. So here we've got search, sort, and filter by drive. If you'd like to uninstall or move an app, select it from the list. So I'm going to click left click into search this list and I'm going to type in there McAfee. It refines the list down to everything that's McAfee on the computer. So what I would suggest is remove anything McAfee that appears in this list. So to do that, we left click once on the program, then move our mouse over uninstall and left click uninstall. Then it says this app and its related info will be uninstalled. So we left click uninstall again. Okay, now it says, do you want to allow this app to make changes to your computer? Now make sure it says McAfee Inc in there and the verified publisher is McAfee Inc. The file origin is on the hard drive on this computer. So if all that's present, then left click yes. Okay, so at the moment now it's going to uninstall McAfee Web Advisor. So I'm going to say here, it says, maybe you should keep us around. Here's why we protect your password and saved and saved you from identity theft. Okay, so no, I'm, I'm, I want to get rid of it, so I'm going to move my mouse over, no thanks, just uninstall it, and left click once. Okay, so it now starts to uninstall. This could take a little while to uninstall. I'm just going to pause this video and we'll come back to it once it's uninstalled. And there we go, it says you've successfully uninstalled WebAdvisor, so I left click done. Okay, and I'm left here with McAfee Total Protection. So once again, I left click McAfee Total Protection, move my mouse over uninstall and left click again. It says there this app and its related info will be uninstalled. So move my mouse over, mouse over uninstall again and left click once. Then it says, do you want to allow this app to make changes to your device? Make sure it says McAfee Inc. and the verified publisher is McAfee Inc. And the file origin is hard drive on this computer. If that's all present and correct, move your mouse over yes and left click once. Okay, so it now says um, we, we need to click left click on the box next to McAfee Total Protection. And then we need to left click the box beside removal files for this program. If you reinst if you reinstall on this PC, you'll need to enter your subscription information again and choose your settings again. Well, if you do plan to uh, reinstall McAfee at any point in the future, then leave this box unticked. But if you don't, left click it to make sure it's ticked. So we've got these two boxes ticked, okay? And then we left click continue. So it says here you still have an acti active subscription. You're about to remove McAfee software but you still have an active subscription by removing your software you'll no longer be covered by our protection against viruses spyware and other threats if you're sure go ahead and remove this software remember you can reinstall at any time using the email address that you provided when you installed the software so yeah i'm okay with that when i take this off the windows security is going to kick in so uh, i move my mouse over continue and left click once now please be aware this may take some time to uninstall. I've noticed on a few uninstalls, the uh, the bar will hang for several minutes. Now on some machines, this has been up to 20 minutes. So uh, best thing to do here is just leave it, walk away from it, come back in sort of five, 10 minutes time, give the mouse a quick wiggle so that it doesn't, uh, the screen doesn't go off or the computer doesn't go into sleep. In actual fact, might be a good idea at this point to plug your computer into the mains if it's running off battery, just so that the battery doesn't run out. Um, but yeah, like I say, this part can take quite a while and it might look as though it has hung. 
so uh, please leave it if it looks as though it's hung leave it for as long as you can if you have to leave it overnight leave it overnight but uh, it can be quite dangerous to try and uh, try and stop or bomb out of uh, uninstalling the program okay what I'm going to do is I'm going to pause this video and I'm going to come back to it when it's nearing the end of the uninstallation Okay, so the uh, software has now been removed and it says to finish removing your McAfee software, close any programs that you have open and restart your PC. So we've got two options here, restart now or restart later. I'm gonna click restart later, left click restart later. I just wanna make sure if there's any uh, programs still listed in the app, underneath the apps and features here, then um, any McAfee program should I say listed there then uh, do the same left click on the program name left click uninstall and then left click uninstall and follow any instructions on the screen to remove them as well one one possible extra you might have is McAfee Central which is installed on some machines as well you might have to remove that okay so once you've uh, once you've uninstalled everything McAfee then we move our mouse over the cross in the top right hand corner left click once to close it down and then we need to restart the machine so don't shut it down actually restart so left click the start button left click the power symbol and then left click restart wait for the machine to restart and that's it you've removed McAfee thanks for watching